Kathy McDonald, parade marshal extraordinaire, brings the field out onto the track for today's 13th and final race. Fourth division of the Ohio Sire Stakes for a three-year-old pacing Colts in the plain one. Whittingham was scratched six. 1A, Nuke the Bunny will go. 1A, Nuke the Bunny owned by Jack Tremonte, Bruce Trogdon, and Ed Mullinax, driven by Dave Hawk. Two, Sam's Gold, owned by Carl Atley, driven by Chip Noble. Three, Diamond Crafts, owned by Rana Stidham, Linda May, and Robert Timmons with Rocky Stidham. Four is the Cannonball Sabra, owned by Skip Miller with Brad Hanners. Five, Direct Zombro, owned by Gene Campbell with Jody Yessig. Six, Look Maynard, owned by Maynard Hagemeyer and Kathy Smith with Jeff Smith. Seven, He a Lucky Star, owned by Leonard Buckner with Jeff Fout. And number eight is Go Nuclear. Owned by Donald Lehman and trainer Jim Arledge, Del S. Miller will be in the sulky. Scratch the plain one, Whittingham, five minutes on the Superfecta. Field 4 race 13 has taken that final turn. Starting gate is underway. Final race pacers are at the gate and moving up. Number 1A, Nuke the Bunny, leaving from post position number 9. Sam's Gold, Diamond Crest, the Cannonball, Sabra, Direct, Zombro, Look, Maynard, He, a Lucky Star, and Go Nuclear. Had a great program today, folks. Hope you enjoyed it. We'll go again tomorrow night. Please join us again on this big festive weekend. Thanks for being part of the live program here today at Scioto Downs. Field is now in motion. And there they go. Off and pacing from between horses. Diamond Crest takes the lead. Sam's Gold sticking him along the rail down the back stretch. After that comes Cannonball. Sarah followed up by Direct Zombro. Look Maynard. He a lucky star. Go Nuclear. And Nuke the Bunny will have to come from the back. Quickly accelerating into command by about two and a half lengths at Sam's Gold. Boy, Diamond Crest had his lunch handed to him in here as they move by the opening quarter mile pole. Sam's Gold is flying away on top in 27 and 2. Off that top turn and racing past the stands. Sam's Gold hoping things will pan out on the front end. Leads by three. Followed in second by Cannonball. Sabra direct Zombro third. Diamond Crest tucked in there fourth. He a lucky star carts up on the outside. He takes Nuke the Bunny with him. After that comes Look Maynard and Go Nuclear is the trailer. The outer tier forms five in, three out there rolling to the half. Jody Essex swings up on the outside. They're at the half mile pole with Direct Zombro trying to chase down Sam's Gold. 57 and 3 up the back stretch. Sam's Gold leads away three parts of a length. Right alongside in second, Direct Zombro. Ranging up on the outside, he a lucky star toward the rail. Cannonball Sabra getting caught in again. Diamond Crest. Diamond Crest a little bit rough. Jumps off stride inside the pylons. The four has fallen. Brad Hanners has gone down again. Racing by three quarters in 127, driving around the far turn. Nuke the Bunny tries to come from the back of the pack, but Sam's Gold continues to lead the way. It's Sam's Gold on top by three. Moving up on the outside, he a lucky star. In between horses, direct Zombro. After that, look Maynard on the far outside, Nuke the Bunny. Chipper is all over Sam's Gold. Here comes he, a lucky star, but Sam's Gold wins the final division of the Sire Stakes.
Bruins gold is a three-year-old black colt by Noble and Sam out of Love and Kissin. Owned in Xenia by Carl Atley. Trained by Josh Green. Driven wire to wire by Chip Noble. Covering the mile in one five direct Zombro fourth. Jerry Knappenberger from the OHHA, the $25.80. 2-7 exact, the 